Hey guys, it's Cassie, and I just wrote my last final exam today, so I'm totally free, and I decided to take the day to visit my friend Tyler and give her a gift that I've been dying to give her. I whipped up a bunch of these mint chocolate bronzing body butters, and I decided to give it to my friend early just because I couldn't wait for Christmas because I'm way too excited. I basically just wanted someone to experience this body butter with me because it's so unreal. I brought her her gift and she was so excited to get it that she ran to the back and then she brought me out a gift which was so nice of her. She got me two bottles of wine and it was just a few minutes before she started working so she asked if I wanted to have a wine tasting because she works at a winery. Red wine is the kind of thing I consider to be a sensible vice as long as you like the stuff and you don't have more than one glass in one sitting. She sat us down and basically just gave us the royal treatment. Wine, cheese, and charcuterie are right up my alley. I was so excited. The place was so beautiful and I was just there to bring her this body butter and she treated me to such a nice gift so thank you so much Tyler after we finished up I asked her if I could take a little video of her outfit because it was so pretty and I figured you guys might like to see it her dress looked like it was maybe $200 but it was $15 from urban behavior the cool thing about Tyler is she's a lot like me in the sense that she likes to be frugal she likes really natural skincare products and stuff so I knew that she would love the body butter Christmas is kind of like the season of garbage, so I really try to reuse everything. Terry got our Christmas tree from a thrift store. The top of our tree, instead of a star, has like the top of a pineapple, and it has a Hawaiian lei that was cut up, wrapped around it, and just some potpourri in there for good measure. Just reusing and making sure that you don't create too much garbage during Christmas time is a really good thing, and that's why I made the body butter. I'll post the ingredients and the directions in the bottom bar, but I'm gonna show you how to make it really quick. Step one, chill a large bowl in an ice bath and set it aside. Next, in a double boiler, you melt cacao butter, shea butter, and coconut oil, and you're gonna need half a cup of each. When I first made it, I forgot to add the shea butter, but it wasn't a big deal, I just melted it and threw it in. Once all of the oil and butter is melted, remove it from the heat, and in a separate bowl, add two tablespoons of pure cacao powder and mix it with half a cup of jojoba oil. After that, you take both of your little concoctions and you add them to the chilled bowl. Add two tablespoons of peppermint essential oil and you let the whole thing just chill for 10 minutes. When you come back to it, take a hand mixer and just whip it real good until it starts to get thicker and lighter in color. And if it gets hard to beat, then just take it out of the ice bath for a bit and whip it on the table. And once it starts to get really thick and light, then throw it back in the ice bath and finish whipping it until it forms stiff peaks. And then you'll get something like this. And to get it to swirl into a jar, I put all of the butter into a Ziploc bag and I snip one of the corners off and just squeeze it into a jar in circular motions. It's all natural and it smells like those chocolate mint after eight things. I've been using mine every day. I love it so much. I put it all over my body and even on my face and I haven't had any problems with it. So try it out if you want. So that's the recipe, I hope you guys like it. Now that I'm off of school, you're probably gonna see a lot more of me, and I was actually considering doing a Draw My Life because I've gotten a few private messages about it, so let me know if that's something you'd be interested in, and I will talk to you guys soon, bye.